Toronto for the Peter Channel New News Report on this Tuesday afternoon, September 20th, 2016. Good afternoon, everybody. I am Peter Wiggins. I am New News Alliance. Top story at noon time on this Tuesday afternoon is the capture of bombing suspect Ahmad Ron Kami. Blog gives an investigator's rare opportunity to try to establish his motivations and affiliations. They can get him to talk. Wells Fargo CEO John Sepp is in front of the Senate Banking Committee to name today and to question about fraudulent accounts opened by Wells employees. Angela Jolie files for divorce from Brad Pitt, Washington, the daughter of Robert Kennedy. Kathleen Kennedy Times in the Senate Facebook post that former Republican and President George H. W. Bush says he's voting for Hillary Clinton. President Obama addressed the United Nations General Assembly with this morning in his final speech before the international government body. Durant cut 40 was shot and killed by Tulsa, Oakland police after his car broke down. The yeah, United Nations Secretary General Ban Ki moon speaks to the President of the 75th Session and the General Assembly Peter Thompson and Muggins let off President of the 75th Session and General Assembly look on during the opening of the summit. Russia and the Syrian government denied Tuesday they were behind air track the humanitarian aid and convoy in northern Syria that killed at least 12 people in Casper Dubs the fate of a ceasefire aimed at bringing the assemblies to calm. Manila, Philippines, a pilot that Saudi Arabian Airlines plane mistakenly pressed to hijack warning button as it approached Manila's airport on Tuesday caused the airport officials to mobilize. Command the forces and isolated the jet after it landed. Dandong, the Chinese province of Nanning, is a major hub for trade in the North Korea. As the police in Northeast China have it, and that's a criminal investigation of the Chinese conglomerate that does extensive trade. Governor Christie of New Jersey and New North Donald Trump in Fort Worth on February 26. As he stood by Chris Christie's by revelations and bridge closing trial. Fuck. Fuck. More than 800 illegal immigrants from countries of concern were set for deportation were mistakenly granted by U.S. citizenship because the Department of Homeland Security didn't have their fingerprints on file when an internal audit released. Tokyo! Typhoon Malakas packed winds of 112 miles hour struck southern Japan with disturbed winds and flooded. Two people are missing and more than 30 are injured. So, North Korea blamed both the Bush and Obama administration for pushing Pyongyang toward the nuclear weapons development. New York, billionaire investor George Soros has pledged up to $500 million investments to assist refugees and migrants worldwide. Book of the Isheri, Venezuela, Venezuela's first division, Triano's FC team were robbed to absolutely everything, including cameras, soft balls, and cleats by gunmen. So, Chinese firm that describes itself as a golden bridge for connected in North Korea and in the world at the center of the U.S. and China probe. King China, Democrat, Republican of Congo, the Democrat of Republican of Congo is singing violent protests. A political site where at least 17 people have died in opposition party headquarters have been burned. In New York, Ivanka Trump thought of Republican nominee Donald Trump is in a sign of full time service, secret service detail, according to the Treasury Department. Washington, UPI, CB. Voter presidential tracking poll released Tuesday shows they look at the beginning and slightly over Donald Trump part the race to the virtual tie. Cambridge, Massachusetts, what if your computer or smartphone can tell you if you're happy or sad? A new development device developed by researchers at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology can detect the person's emotions using wireless signals to affect the person's body to measure human behavior. Researchers from MIT's Computer Science and Artificial Intelligence Laboratory says that EQ radio device is 87% accurate in telling if someone is excited, happy, angry, or sad. Boston, the Massachusetts Bay Transportation reported it could potentially increase capacity at the busy red line about 50% and it spends millions of dollars on new train cars. The deal is initially for $20.35 per share in cash, according to the statement from Algen. The deal can balloon much more. U.S. has its heart stumble funding in the South Plain. Factual Smith declined PLC. New chief executive looked like one of the bosses at large pharmaceutical companies of graduate of Oxford with worldwide experience, managed a thousand employees. U.S. Senator John McCain made some hefty promises Friday when he met with Nava Lady, who was turned around the table of discussion in St. Michael's, Arizona. San Diego, government reports that it received a series of orders for radio frequency microwave tons to support an F-35 Lightning II program. Washington, General Dynamics, land system and men with a 9 mil dollar U.S. Army contract modification for tooling and engineers supported a striker vehicle. Washington, Harris Cover Operation Men awarded a $54 million U.S. Air Force contract for engineering work on an ANL Q-172 aircraft countermeasure system. Mobi, Alabama, the U.S. Navy's future expeditionary fast transport ship, the USNS Human, was launched from an airstall USA shipyard Saturday service at 
Washington has L3 communications, better sex, airspace, and more than 166 million dollars. U.S. Navy contract modification for support service for the T 45 trainer aircraft. New York for support, but sentiment and energy markets that slipped back toward the supply side pushed the crude oil prices sharply lower in early Tuesday training. Moscow, frustration among the Republican and Russian main bill ahead. The 2018 presidential contest that the government tried to adjust the low oil ratings agency said. Battle Creek, Michigan, about 10,000 cases of ego due to green whole wheat waffles were bound to recall because they might be contaminated with listeria. Kellogg Company said. All right, take a look at the stocks now. Is up 32.83 points at 18,173. SP5 up 4.45 at 2143 for 57. And NASDAQ up 10.45 for 5,245.47. Red Floyd was only three minutes in the first half of the first day. 29 year old and the carrot. Ship when a colleague came swimming over him. Mars at elite says recently it's two billion, three billion years ago. New search is in which along with science of leaders is warming up to help with liquid water. In the first two separate teams, the research has successfully carried out long distance question, teleportation use a commercial optical fire. Red networks. Russia today's next crew to launch a space station. Fitness track was rain, while they popped up a day to make a fit. Maybe not. According to the study that I was over with it, yet BC Young adults use a tiny tracking tools to lose weight. The Food and Drug Administration Monday approved the first drug to treat the shame milk to disappear well, and lethal muscle weakening disorder that affects about 15,000 Americans. For those who have been signed in the alarm about worsome drug and drug resistant bacteria they upcoming the UN General Assembly meeting on my entire macbar resistance as a welcome regulation to the, the gravity of the problem. Imagine it's lunch, you all done fight slash watermelon. It looks delicious. You move about but some go to serve one as a five second group for even food science is just demonstrating how gross it is. New York, Hillary Clinton is only two battle plans straight this week. How does the Senate come into the Senate in 49 days before the election? But the announcement that one task remains above all. Preparing for first face to face debate with Donald Trump. Tallahassee, Florida. Florida Attorney General Pam Bondi wrote Tuesday to her decision three years ago to solicit $25,000 from Donald Trump with the same questions. Or by rising about the Trump University, New York. Staring down, tightening the polls, both nationwide and in the battleground states. Who could the campaign manager? Robbie Booker and Monday circulated private member of the donors, supporters, and top voters at the map side of Democratic. Peter Chow News on 12.07 p.m. on this Tuesday afternoon, and it's time now for Sports Report. Tonight, the Boston Red Sox will be taking on Baltimore Orioles at Kevin Yards. Game time, 7.05 p.m. And the Norton Lancers girls soccer team will have a game against the Bills Bohawks. Bit of an Eagles right tackle lane shots that scheduled a very little on October for to avoid potential 10 games since the following league's performance strike and answer drug policy for a second time. After two starts when rookie cost the Eagles didn't find themselves in a place where they had to hype up their quarterback in public. After yes, I'll pick Grandis soft Grinder, he had worked with Madison for coming into three needing survey with cost that went to the player. The New York Giants may have to play without safety. Michael Thompson of Santa Period of Time. Monday head coach Ben McAdoo said that the second year safety will be out of a few weeks of a knee injury. Peter Childers time is now twelve oh eight on this Tuesday afternoon and it's time now for traffic and transit report. Baby! Let's have you in the MTA where the ferry's out. Looking good on the subway. Red Line's place for Mono Laser to disable train at Porter. And on the commuter rail, please put off Whistler Line trains on the inbound forms of West Native at Wellesley Farms. And otherwise, commuter rail lines out. Looking good. How was in Bowie's of the 6th state New England region on this Tuesday afternoon? Starting off in Connecticut with 95 of the stop lines. I backed up at Norwalk and Backed up from Greenwich all the way out to 287 and Tappan Zee Bridge in New York State. Merritt Parkway stop lines are backed up around the Norwalk stretch. 95 on the northbound side, backed up between Norwalk and Bridgeport. A4, westbound side, backed up the Newtown stretch. A4, eastbound side, is backed up to I-91 and Harvard, Connecticut. 130 on the northbound side, westbound side, the Newport Bridge, it's also headed towards Jamestown. But I was in my ways, Rhode Island, I'm looking good. Southeast of Massachusetts and Cape Cod, I was not looking good, except the Route 3, the southbound side, Little Sword, Elks Grove, Stretch, and Plymouth. 20, the southbound side, backed up after the Board Bridge, all the way down to Bourne. Route 3 is outbound side, back to number 4. 120 in Burlington. 120 in the northbound side, back to my Route 3 in Burlington. Mm, 91 on both ends. It's back. It's looking good from New Haven all the way up into the Vermont border on both ends, except for the southbound side, 91 and 89. Southbound side, also after the Canadian border up in Vermont. Main Tobago southbound side is backed up around 202 up in Gray, Maine. 87 the southbound side. It is backed up around. Road 11 in Champlain, New York, after the Canadian border, and New York State 3 is looking for, from New York to Erie, Pennsylvania, except a little slow spot on New York State 3, just around Irving, New York, just around Route 438. Peter Childers, I'm his name, 1209 on this.
Tuesday afternoon, and it's time now for a weather report. It's a tropical storm call. Second location, 20.0 in the north, 54.3 to the west. Mass sustained winds at 40 miles an hour. Movement west at 17 miles an hour. And Club Advisory, call movement west with the north change of strength. But there are no close marks of warning effects at 11 a.m. at a certain time. The center of tropical storm call was located in the latitude 20.0 in the north, longitude 54.3 to the west. Calls moving toward in the west near 17 miles an hour. West northwest with this move, northwestward motion is uh, slightly slow. Forward speed is affected later today in five Thursday. Max team was down near 40 miles an hour. Guess seven straight minutes forecast during the next four hours. And top storm force winds extend hours up to 140 miles. 228 kilometers in the north and center. It's a minimum set pressure 1006 mil miles. 20 amps, say one inches. And now, Lisa, 40 mile power winds with a set location 15.3 to the north, 30.4 to the west. Mountain but northwest at 12 miles an hour. And the pressure straight into the top storm Lisa over eastern tropical Atlantic and northern coast watching borders affected at 11 a.m. Atlanta Center time. The center of tropical storm Lisa was located in the latitude 15.3 to the north. Lines are 3.4 to the west. Lisa is moving toward the northwest near 12 miles an hour. This still most of the expected activity by Thursday. Max today with that increase near 40 miles an hour. With higher cast, some initial stream is forecast during the next four hours. And Trump's on the fourth winds and ends up to 70 miles from the center. It's been a minimum set pressure of 1,007 mil bars at 24 inches. All right, let's take a look at a seven day forecast. It goes like this. Oh, let's take a look at. Some radar in it shows a line of rain showers stretching North Carolina, Stan Patrol, and stretching out to sea. Little line of rain showers are east of Nantucket and the Petra Rain Showers, southeast of Long Island Sound. Petra Rain Showers around in Keene, New Hampshire. All right, 7 day forecast goes like this. Mid afternoon, sky shot, maybe before 1 p.m. Pots has covered 81 degrees southwest, about 3 to 5 miles high, chest feature 30%. Tonight, press back after 1 a.m. watts. Pots has covered about 62 degrees, light south wind. Wednesday, Sunday, most schools covered 82 about 52 degrees, light northwest wind, and calm wind. Thursday, Sunday, Paul Cox, but it's about 60 degrees. Coming, becoming southwest when 5 miles in the afternoon. Per. Friday, most of the afternoon, 80 degrees. Friday, that. Chester showers after 7 p.m. Most of the about 57 degrees. Chest patients, 50 percent. Saturday, Sunday, Paul Cox, but it's 60 about 46 degrees. Sunday, Sunday, most of the afternoon, 60 about 43 degrees. And from Monday, Sunday, got it, 67 degrees. Currently, and not near, it is a overcast day, and the temperature is. 74 degrees out in Totten and at Naughton, 77 degrees. The humidity of 87%. And that is going to be it for the Peter Channel New News Report on this September 20th, 2016 on a Tuesday evening. I'm Tuesday afternoon. I'm Tuesday afternoon. Good afternoon and good positive day to all. See you for a 5 o'clock evening news report at the Norton Middle School or 5 or 6 o'clock. Hope you have a good afternoon.